Here I'm going to show you the app called Retouch. Well, it's called Touch Retouch. So you load up the application like this, and we're going to select a folder. We're going to choose the one of the Eiffel Tower. Now, as you can see, we have a tree in the way of this nice shot of the tower. Now, what this app does is it basically removes anything in the background or things that are in the picture itself. So like if a branch was hanging over the tower, like in front of it, you'd be able to remove it. Or say if there's a power line running behind it, and you can see it. Okay. So what we do is we're going to click the brush right here. And then you can choose the size, how big you want the brush to be. And then you just kind of set up here. And then we just keep on brushing. And just to note, the more you brush, the longer it's going to take to uh, process the image. I'll show you another image after I'm done with this one. So you just make sure that she's all red. It's kind of like cropping out an item in Photoshop, but doing it on your iPad. And then we hit go. And then we sit here and wait for a little bit. We'll process this is the image. And it could take up 30 seconds to one minute because that is a pretty big section that we are processing. And after it's done, it should remove that tree from this photo. As if I did it right. And let's see. I give it about 30 more seconds and it will be done. A night. It's a pretty neat app. Um, you can purchase it in the app store, but I'm not sure how much it is. I think it's maybe it's either 99 cents or all the way up to 3.99. I can't remember. Okay, as you can see, it goofed up a bit. So that's all right. So we can just just crop that sucker out too if you want, and just do that. And there you have it. You see how fast that went. Now take a look to make sure show you the real image. I'm gonna go back. And that's after the crop on the first one. It, I don't know for some reason it moved it over. And that's what it looks like when we're cropping. And that's the original image. I'll show you again. Cropped, cropped, finish. Okay, now I'll show you another image. Let's see if I can find one. I wanted to show you one of like a tower behind. Let's see. I can find it somewhere in here. Okay, it has to be in here somewhere. And I'll find it eventually. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting close. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Yeah, right there. So as you can see, there's a tower behind him, right? So what we do is you can zoom in, take a brush, you want to lower it down a little bit, and then you want to lower the brush a little bit more, and then hit go, processing, look at that. Now as you can see there's still a little bit of it left, so we can make our little a little bit smaller and rub that out a little bit. 
Let it go. See if it does any more work. It's removing it more. And but you can still see a little bit of it right there. If it moves a little bit more. And that's probably because of the red shirt. I bet it's gonna pull the red shirt over. Okay, see look at that. Got rid of that. Now we still have a little bit more right here. Let's see how well that works. See it's slowly moving that out. But it's still putting more red stuff into that shirt. But say if we wanna get like now here I'll move out. See now look at that. No towel whatsoever. Now, yeah, say like some of these people here. We can get rid of some of these people if you don't want them in the picture either. Nope. And we can keep going like this. It's a pretty sweet app, I think. And then we hit go. It should remove them. Look at that. People gone. Ain't that awesome? You can see they're not there anymore. See, I'll do a, I'll do a back button push so you guys can see. See who they are. Oops. Look at that. There they are, and then we'll just go forward, dropping. I guess I lost track of that. But that's basically it. That's how cool it is. See you later.